Hello, everybody, and welcome to another Spark of Genius Flesh and Blood production. Here were some classic constructed gameplays. So we had the uh, the Viscera, the Viscera deck tech, the, the ProQuest deck tech winner, Andrew, uh, coming on here, winning his um, winning his 40 man, uh, 40 man PQ. So he came on and talked a little bit about his list. I have um, made some adjustments to the list. I had to more or less mirror his list. There's only one change, I believe. He had a one blue meet and greet. I changed it for a blue Amplified Arknight. Not for any particular reason. I just don't really like blue meet and greet. Uh, I'm okay with the reds. I think blue is just a little bit too weird for me. So I just changed it for a blue Amplify. Other than that, it's the exact same list. Um, I am joined by my co-creator, co-commentator, co-caster, co-compatriot, Rob on the top. He's going to be on uh, Levi's Azalea. Mm-hmm. Let's call Levi's Azalea. It is, it is Azalea, right? But it seems to be like the more standard one. Everyone's just copying whatever he's got, more or less. Not exactly, but... Yep. Uh, so it's going to be Viscera into Azalea. We haven't brought Viscera back for a little while, but not a ton has changed with Viscera because there's really like not a lot that came out of Dynasty that really improved him a significant amount. Deathly Duet was kind of a bit of a side grade. It's okay, but... Mm-hmm. I don't really know. I'm not really like hassling Andrew to like. I did ask him about it because Cassano was meh. I kind of agree. It's kind of meh. Um, so this is this is the matchup as far as the sideboarding. Uh, Andrew's list doesn't really have a sideboard for us. I don't think he was expecting an Azalea. <laughs> that, therefore, I don't have a sideboard for you know, Azalea. Can't blame um, him all that much, right? No. Um, I think like as far as the sideboard goes, like there's a race face which doesn't do anything to Azalea because. Arrows are arrows. There's no talents. Like, there's really nothing that yep. you're stopping with a race face. Um, Runic Reclamation, it's really for, like, Briar and, like, uh, Popper, stuff like that. It doesn't really do anything for Azalea. Uh, the Sink Belows, you could run the Sink Belows, but the issue is that if you're replacing, like, some aggressive cards, it's kind of like, well, if you're on the defense, maybe you have, like, maybe you just want gas, essentially. Uh, sink Belows, I'm... I, I think based on what he framed it as it's more for guardians if anything because those ones really stop you uh whereas azalea not all the arrows are equal like of course there's like red ledger but you can still do things where red ledger mm-hmm. can still like do on action it's not like terrible i'm not really a super go wide deck i can do other things that are like big one card hands um and then there's this round's on me which is not for azalea it's yeah i'm for not five. a wide deck <laughs> yeah it's for five it's definitely that against five. me Mm-hmm. No, yeah, I, I bet you would. So that that's really like his sideboard. So yeah. I'm just like, all right, I'm just going to run the 60 aggro. Yeah. Uh, that being said, I think this still I have nothing here. I am running Tunic. I, I did loan out my one of my decks after I played PQ to one of my locals. So some of my staples are in there. So I am proxying CNCs in the Tunic here. Um, I am running Tunic instead of Iron Weave because I think Iron Weave is mainly for the races like yep. uh when you're racing aggro briar either mirror five decks like that so that you can block and just get the two like the the game might not last six plus turns whereas tunic won't get the value whereas iron wheel is like a two immediately essentially off a non attack attack um so i don't think that game is gonna be nearly that quick uh unless i just sack the shit out of rob but mm-hmm. I, I don't i don't think that's super likely uh and crown of providence regular crown grasp and creepers there is no other like everything else is just null rune and then there is vex and quill hand but i think again quill hand is for like the viscera I, briar Dex, like like viscera I, briar and then possibly mm-hmm. like ice Lander or something like that okay. um but yeah. there's like yeah crown of dichotomy obviously kano ice Lander. so it's there's not again this deck is not teched for probably ranger at all which is fair it's just local meta right so that's it's exactly. kind of like what he's teching it against so for anyone watching like yeah. if you're expecting a whole lot of like azalea and lexis i would probably not bring this particular deck. I don't think it's going to go super well, but uh, let's go into uh, Rob's set. Yeah, so we are running Levi's Azalea deck that we did do a deck tech on. I'm just, I just keep the same deck because it's probably one of the best builds out there for Azalea. The cards I did take out of the deck, uh, I am going a bit more defensive since uh, Viscerai is a pretty aggressive hero, especially if he gets like the good, you know, Revels and stuff like that. So I took out the Rain Razors. I did take out three Red Sigils in favor of D Reacts. Um, it's very nice to be able to block, you know, a single Shrill with a D React plus a three block. That's you know buffed by Marion Skies. So I put all the three Sinks, all the three Fate for Scenes in this deck. I took out that all you got. It is good against Rosetta, but I don't want to clunk up my deck too much with D-Reacts, so this is mostly like a 5-tech mm. card right now. 
and I took out one of the buffing cards, the Read the Glide Path. There are better ones in the deck. This is a yellow, but uh, you know I think we want to keep the other ones instead. And lastly, two red headshots. I was debating between this and I believe was the uh, not sleep dart, the um, fatigue, fatigue no. shot. Yeah, I was debating between was these two and fatigue shot. shot. I kept fatigue shot even though it's one less power because you know if I hit, it'll make his attack at least two less. So it's not that bad. Um, and then I did play the um i am playing the um sorry snaps. the snap snapdragon scalers instead of the uh sorry they're in french so <laughs> the perch grapplers um <laughs> god damn uh, it they're supposed two, to speak this two block isn't as crucial into viscerai and the on hits you know i'm trying to cover that with d reacts anyway i'd rather have a window where i can go super wide with snaps rather than having the extra two block um because yep. this deck you know we might you know, I might get fatigued if I'm going too defensive. Uh, so I do want at least one way to claw back towards the end. Uh, towards the end, sorry. <laughs> and that's it. Yeah. Yeah, that is fair. It, it is it is a reasonable assumption. Like, if Azalea is going more fatigued, you need not more fatigue, but going more defensive. You still need a way to win the game. You're the one without the weapon. Exactly. As Azalea, as Ranger in general. You don't have the weapon. You can block as much as you'd like, but you still need to win the game because the other hero has a weapon. So if yeah. all I do is pitch in blue, create a create a um, rune chant and swing that's yeah. going to be two cards like one pitch and then one right. block so eventually you're just going to yeah. be losing cards so I'm definitely on eventually the, the ranger when it comes to something. late game so yeah, yeah completely right exactly um yep. i do have ab2 here uh, built in pretty much into my main equipment so that's nice is, if i use the bullseye nice bracers to like... exactly and if i, if I yeah. want to pop the bullseye that's fine i still have ab1 for your rune chance yep. so it's just yeah. the rosetta which is one leak which is like normal yeah, compared to everybody it's... else other than like hold him and stuff or like uh yeah. wizard who like automatically think... have ab I think most heroes that go into Visceride don't even bother with AB2. They're like, you know, just... Especially not aggro. No, exactly. Um, okay, ready to roll? Ready to roll. We'll get back to KO one day. Yeah. Nine. I got an eight. Ooh. All right, what do oh. you want? Uh, I don't I don't really remember how, like... Because it's like... Yeah. His deck wants to play a very specific way versus aggro, but it doesn't really account for rangers. You can probably uh, assume one they're in... roughly the same. However, I'm I'm not really that aggressive because I don't have that much go again. Yeah, my turn one plays um, in this deck are kind of mediocre compared to a regular Viscerai deck, so I'm a little bit wary of going first. But I think I'm still going to go first because uh, I am on Tunic. So at That's least fair. I get that benefit. Uh, I do have a Read the Runes in the deck. Uh, my own, my own list before has... Yeah, my own list has multiple. Uh, yeah. Speak of the devil, there's Read the Runes. I just happened <laughs> to draw it. That's wow. that's how you play. Very lucky. That's how you play. Uh, that's how you play like how you Rob. Play, uh, <laughs> not how you play this, right? In a nutshell, go first, run the uh, the read. All right, I guess you're just gonna play that. Create a rune chant. Uh, grasp. yeah. <laughs> grasp. Read the runes. So. Yeah, I'm just thinking about what I want to arsenal at this point. To be honest with you mm -hmm. here, uh, and I also want to try to get some like less good card my, my hand is absolute dog so i'd like to get some of these to the bottom it's a very good thing i went first and not second because uh, if you like did nothing and made me come back second i have no attack actions in my head so <laughs> let's uh let's remedy that shall we yikes uh so i'm gonna pitch uh, the red rattle bones and the blue lead the charge to grasp so I, i'm putting you know over pitching to um to do that uh do i want to do that i do right because then i want to do that yeah that's fine uh so that's one rune chant i have two here but yeah one's for so kind of the one that, one that you're actively chant. attacking yeah yeah yeah, yeah exactly exactly <laughs> yeah exactly so I'll, I'll use that uh and then i'll play the read the runes so i'll go up to four mm -hmm. uh and i'll pass fantastic turn one i'm gonna tunic yeah i mean um, the only only better turn one would have been uh moff uh not moff uh mordred the, the only arrow in my hand right now is a blue bolt and shot. <laughs> uh, it seems that we're both getting really bad open airs, but um, I am going first. I can actually like cycle. I can buff it so much though; it's not even funny. So I'm gonna do that uh, sure. first. I will pitch Memorial Grounds to Death Dealer. Memorial mm -hmm. Grounds really good in the anti fatigue kind of strategy. Um, especially drawing it first and pitching it is not that bad because you can see it later in the game. So I'm gonna yep. draw. Oh, sorry. I will. <laughs> I will load the blue bolt and shot. And I will draw a card. Yeah, oh my like, Sir. goodness. I'm just going to draw it's gonna a card. It's going to be a fat, gonna be a draw, fat draw a better shot. arrow and put that one in first. Eh? <laughs> uh, oh, that's not, yeah. Hmm. OK. 
Okay. Well, there's not much I can really do with this. Um, I mean, it is only turn probably. one, so it's not like... Yeah, I'm not like... You have that. literally no setup. Like, it's it's whatever you have as you have, right? For sure, for sure. Let's play Read the Glide Path. I will opt one. Sure. Plus three. Um, it is plus three. I'll keep that on top. It's not bad. And with that, I will then play a Take Aim, buffing it by three more. And yeah. I'll fire. It's going to be for eight. Go again, technically. That's terrifying. Um... <laughs> Blue bullet and shot for eight. <laughs> It's how we do things. Yeah. This is pure damage. Um, yep. Not a super big fan of like... Just taking it. Blocking raw damage in this uh, deck. Because I really don't have a way to like... Like slow the game down that much as Mr. I. With this deck especially. Yeah. So I think I'm going to... Could have go to... This feels so, feels so weird. Because like I play aggro decks. But it's like... Eight is just like even for that. I'm like ah. Uh, usually I'd be going second, but it's just like well. There I, is a reload man, on hit, good. by the way. It's fine. <laughs> okay. What yeah, am I gonna do? Block eight? I'm not like, wrestling. <laughs> yeah, like the the thing is like I know you have a reload. However, uh, okay, so I stop it by blocking eight. Like if you said like going for three reload on hit, yeah, maybe you could tempt me into yeah. giving up a card, but yeah. like, um, it's fair. Okay, tunic. Okay. Huh. Am I feeling lucky punk? <laughs> um, We're going to find out. Sonata Arcanics. X is zero. X is zero? Okay. Not yeah. tempted to X pitch a blue into this? Um, Am I tempted to pitch a blue into this? Are you trying to tempt me? Are you trying to be a temptress, Rob? There is a, uh, a chance of a really big payout and get two cards. Uh, well, I got the blue. <laughs> so I'll take Spellblade Assault, all I can do. Okay, yep. And then I will uh, shuffle I and then shuffled. banish. Uh, the one arcane I will... Oh, yeah. that's sad. I'll take it. Sure. So I go to 39 as I shuffle my deck. Yep. And I put Sonata into the banish zone because I'm a, I'm a strong you player. play properly, yeah. <laughs> Tell me about it. Well, I am. <laughs> I just did. <laughs> Uh, wow, this feels so weird to play. I haven't played Viss in so long, just because he's like, just you know what I mean. Just yep. hasn't really been a reason to, to be honest. Mm -hmm. um, Until the deck okay. tech. <laughs> Until the deck tech, yeah. Um, okay, so let's uh, Moss guys blue from Arsenal. So Visser, I will trigger getting me a rune chant. Mm -hmm. So I'm up to five. I keep forgetting. It's like when I put this on the banish, I'm like, yes, yes, yes. This is the second one. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I guess I'll pitch the spell blade assault to. Mm. Can I start off swinging. Uh, let's do the shrill of uh, skull form here. So I have one floating. Uh, this is going to create a rune chant, and these five rune chants are going to come in. So. Okay. It's a red shrill? Uh, five, five rune chants. It's a red shrill, but a blue moth. So oh. it's only going to create one on hit. Yeah. But it's going to be five rune chants. It's coming in for seven. It's funny how you usually do this to me, and I'm just like, this sucks. But now I'm doing it to you. Yeah, it still sucks. Which is interesting. Yeah, I bet. Um, okay. Okay. I. You didn't pay for take... the one rune chant. Well, you pay for the five. No, I'm taking all five. The shrill is interesting. Um... I, seven. I can't. <laughs> seven's awkward in, in Azalea because you can't really block it fully without a D react. Or you can't block it nicely without a D react. I don't have one. Yeah. Um, mm. I'm sorry to hear that. Four. Yeah. I was thinking of leaking four damage here. Um, does have a go again. So Rosetta's definitely a threat. <laughs> yeah. Here's a. Oh, man. Yeah. Here's six. And I'll take one. So I'll create a rune chant off Mops, guys. Mm -hmm. Sure. Um, it's interesting. Put these here. So I could just Rosetta and then save this card, or I can. My original plan was to play one of these cards from hand, but I didn't know how you're going to block. Mm -hmm. I think this is a, a pretty reasonable time to use this. So I'm going to use my last pitch to consuming volition. Uh, the reason I'm doing this is because of your blocking pattern. Mm-hmm. Uh, so I'm going to create a rune shen off the back of Volition, and I'm going to come in with these two rune shens that I had before. 
so my assuming so not always discard a card yeah on hit discard card comes in for four so it's two arcane and four uh the reason i didn't rosetta there is mainly because i think your your one card like your one kind of hands like dead in the water essentially like you need two cards to function i think so i think if i force a card here it's pretty good that's a fair assumption Again, so, I don't play a lot of Viscera, so if I'm wrong, flame me in the comments. That's fine. Uh, well, it feels like you're right, because this feels terrible. Um, I'll take the two rune chants. I, yep. A full hand of red, <laughs> so there's no rune chant oh, blocking. one of those. Yeah, one yeah, of those. You don't, you, don't, you don't run tons of blues. You run yellows, but you don't run yeah. a ton of blues. That's true. There's think. probably a handful of blues in the deck. Uh, a good Knock amount of yellow. And, like some blue arrows. Yeah. yeah, Yeah. exactly. They're all yellow. Uh, they're all, sorry, they're all arrows. Yeah, you, you fired the blue bolt and shot at me. Oh. <laughs> This might be a full block scenario, honestly. The one is so annoying. So on hit, of course, I discard a card. Yeah, you discard a card. Uh, yeah, I can't keep it. I'll, I'll block with um, for five with Red in the Ledger and uh, oh, yes. read the Glide Path. Yep. Yes, come, come to me, to Red in the Ledger. That. Get in the grave. <laughs> I will take it, gladly. It wasn't worth taking the full damage and keeping a very kind of mediocre hand. Uh, so yeah. It's okay. So now we're even, um, we're which even. is okay. Yeah. It doesn't feel amazing, but... <laughs> well, I lost the red in the ledger, which is pretty big. Um, That's true. I'll tunic and Your just turn pass is just tunic you. pass. Yep. Okay, uh, so my turn is going to be tunic. Uh, I'm not going to pass because I don't have to. No. Uh, I think I'm going to pitch this moth skies to grasp and go up to two. So I have no floating, but... Um... You pitched a yellow moth? No, I pitched a blue moth, but I had one rune chant. Uh, but you must have one so, floating, right? Oh, you had. I'm sorry. Yes, it costed three. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. Been a while since I've used it on, <laughs> not on a single, you know, rune chain. Yeah, I know. Um, I'm gonna lay rune flash using the tunic. So okay, I need the one. I need the one because I only have two rune chants, right? So right, uh, this is coming in for two rune chants and four go again. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, I'll take the rune chance again <laughs> for two, and mm -hmm. I will be blocking uh, for three here with a uh, fatigue shot. So I'll take one. Sure. Mm. I'm gonna swarming gloom veil here. Okay. Uh, so it's gonna create a rune. Uh, it's not gonna create a rune chant, but it's just gonna come in for a three go again. Oh yeah, because you only created one aura. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'll block you yeah. here with. Uh, oh, it's actually not bad. Nah, I'll block with sleep dart three more sure. uh and then i am going to get a pitch revel mm. uh yeah my pitch That's was kind of awkward honestly <laughs> mm. i probably could have uh, sequenced it a little bit better but it's fine uh i'm gonna come at you with uh vexing malice which is actually slightly better than rosetta at the moment but the non attacks so it's gonna be uh two arcane and one physical two oh it's the blue yeah um i'll take yeah. it all take three Mm -hmm. All right. Tunic. I assume it's my turn. Yes, your turn. Okay. Tunic to three. Uh, I will use the cross trap to flip over a dead eye. Uh, sure. Opting one. That I'm going to bottom. Uh, one sec. Let's see what I actually want. Um, if I do this, yeah, I'm going to bottom that for sure. Yeah. Um, thinking about Azalea, it will be blind. <laughs> Fair enough. But it's kind of crazy. I think what I'll do is um, I will use the Tunic Charge to play Deadeye. Sure. I want plus it to three. get like a, a zero costed buff, but, you know, Deadeye's okay. So it's it's plus three. At least I can guarantee a buff. Um, and then I'm going to pitch for Death Dealer. Yep. I'll load a Remorseless draw card. Okay. Um, yeah, let's fire it for eight. These all red hands are real awkward. Let me let me tell you that. <laughs> so, yeah, I know. Uh, Especially if you have to block Arcane. Okay. Yeah. Arsenal. Yeah, I know. I just, I just, I don't think. Like again, this isn't one of like those heavy disruption turns, so I don't think I can, you know, afford to block and wait till I draw a red in the ledger, something like that. Pretty much. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna pitch. Two meet and greets, lol. Uh, this is Command and Conquer. Oh, yeah, it's quite good. Um, yeah, so I'll take one. Yeah. For anything. And then... Okay, let's see. Yeah. This should be a one. Probably worth keeping here. 
Now this is kind of annoying because I can't skull bone cross wrap without an arsenal. Yeah, I know. Um, that, that, I'm mainly like trying to get off chip damage, right? I really don't want to let you like just dominate and chip, dominate and chip. Yeah. I do. I do have armor. I do have a reasonable amount of armor too, yeah. but I'd rather. I'd rather keep the armor for like a big red the ledger or like a big whatever, right? Oh, for sure. Yeah. Um, this I'm actually just gonna take it fully, so I'll give you a ravenous rabble. Sure. I'm okay with giving that. It, it wasn't a threatening arrow or anything. Seems reasonable. Mm. Over to you. Okay, it's Nick. This might be a faster game than I thought. <laughs> I said I was being defensive, but I'm just taking everything. Uh, True. Mainly because it was just a CNC. I didn't really care about the arsenal, so. That... And, yeah, I, it and I couldn't fully block this without giving you like two cards, two good cards. So yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's do. Let's do Death Dealer. See what I draw. Sure. Uh, pitch the blue headshot there, and I will sure. load a Remorseless again. Oh, um, sure. you took one from the CNC, right? Just double checking. Yeah, I was a twenty-four. Okay. Yeah. Now I'm a twenty-three. Sounds good. Draw a card. Hmm. Let's start with a Ravenous Rabble. It okay. is a <laughs> blue bolden shot. So coming in for a two hole damage. Easiest two 21. of your life. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not the easiest, but I'm just like it's up there. <laughs> yeah, what exactly how exactly would I sleep at night if I block that, you know? Here's a seek and destroy. This might Oh, that's this might cruel. pique your interest a little bit. Um and I'll spend one to fire the remorseless for eight. <laughs> this might incentivize you to block a little bit. Yes. More than eight, friend. Uh, did I miscount that? No, it should be eight. It's three from Seek and Destroy and eight at uh, five. No, 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 no. Not literally. I mean that oh, once it's... I do things on my turn. <laughs> oh, that's a good remorseless. Hmm. Any other error I probably would have been okay with. <laughs> I don't I mean. think I can give you... My hand is just really bad if I block with two cards here. That's fair. So... I'm gonna take five here. Um, okay, I will snap on this. <laughs> sure. And you're gonna be a little sad. I'm gonna crack the bullseyes and load a second remorseless and fire for five more. Uh, okay. I mean, that's fine because you cracked snaps. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah, and this can be blocked with a single card plus grasp, which is it's okay. Yeah, I'm actually not sad. Funnily oh, enough, okay, because I was. I'm actually happier the, the you two, did that. The two points per per action would have been no, because bad. this is this this is actually going to save me a lot of health because I was just going to go ahead with my plan and I would have taken another three to four damage off your first remorseless. Oh, okay, I'm okay. So now I'm literally I'm making the choice easy like, for you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, pr pretty much. Fair enough. Um, fair enough. Okay. Yeah, yeah this would have been better with, if you didn't uh, block at all, I guess. But you know, it's yeah, you're being a little light. I'm going to block with. Okay. Moth Shrill. That's fine. That's yeah. fine. So I, I, so wanna... I had a blue, oh. red Shrill, and yellow Moth. So I was going to come in with it. So didn't want to use the Grasp there instead of the Moth? Like I said. Uh, there's no point. Because even if I keep... Like, if I keep Moth, my last is blue Shrill. So what do I do with blue Shrill Moth? Okay. <laughs> okay, yeah. And, you and then losing, the same you're point, losing the Arsenal. What do I do so. with... Yeah. Uh, yeah, but... So, I mean, you Arsenal. couldn't save a card to Arsenal because it would be gone anyway with Seek and Destroy. So I, your play makes sense. Yeah, the other play I could have done was uh, Crown of Providence. Um, oh, however, true. since I let the first remorseless hit, yeah, um, that's true. I I wouldn't be able to arsenal end of turn, right? Because that that's end of turn. If yeah, I understood yeah, that correctly. It, exactly. Yeah. Let me uh, let me quickly read that for everybody. Yeah. Your next arrow gains plus three at the beginning of the if this hits at the beginning of their next end phase, they discard all cards in their hand and destroy all cards in the arsenal. So yeah, so it's beginning it, of it's, phase. Yeah. Yeah. Um Yeah, so it is Mordred Tide. I will take one here. Okay. Uh and then I'll pitch to uh make two rude chance. Okay. Yeah. Don't take damage off that. No. And that's it. Should yeah, be so fine. I mean second remorseless is second remorseless, is not <laughs> nothing I could do about it. Yeah. Uh over to you. Okay, that's fair. And nothing left in hand in Arsenal, right? Uh no, I, I just drew up these four. I okay. My arsenal was Mordred, my last card in hand was Shrill. I actually drew some nice Pretty blue. Good. I was ready to block some, some arcane damage. Look, man, um, you can't snaps and hit me and then be like, oh, I have blues now. You could attack me. <laughs> like, oh, attack me with sir? whatever feeble stuff you have left. That's fine. That's fair. Yes, sir? Uh, let's pitch for Death Dealer. I'll pitch the blue Bolton shot to load a red. 
bolt and shot. Mm -hmm. Drawing a card. Wow. Okay, I'll play take. Oh, actually, no. Sorry, that might be a mistake. Um, hmm. No, I guess it's fine. I'll play take aim. And yep. I'll fire the bolt and shot. Should be coming in for seven, I believe. Again, hand is uh, not doing super good for me here. Uh, three, four, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Want to use the uh, the crown? Um. No, not particularly. Mm, okay. Um, I'm afraid I'm just gonna like draw ass. So. <laughs> That's fair. I'm just gonna move to Arsenal then. Sure. No, uh, no on hit anyway, so I can't reload. All right. Yeah, that that was that was the main reason I full block because I'm just like you don't have um, bullseye anymore, so you actually need to like have an attack reaction. If you're running attack reactions and defense reactions and reg like I feel like I feel like you wouldn't do that. But, That's you fair. Know. Yeah. Um. Okay. So tunics are three. I have two options here, so I can try to shift the tempo. I don't really have that good of a hand for tempo, but I have this and this. Do I want to just do this? I guess I will. Um, Mordred Tide. Ah. Uh, pitching Arc Knight Shard. Oh, that's not, not bad. Yeah. So go to four, um, I believe. Four. Uh, no, I'm not pitching for Mordred. Doesn't cost anything. I'm pitching Arc Knight Shard for. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, salt. But you'll so go to four will... uh, rune chance because you pitched. Yeah, I'll go to. F yeah. You'll create uh... another one for Mordred. I'm pretty sure it's how it works, right? No. Yeah, this hasn't resolved yet. Like, the the, the cost of Mordred Tide... But the cost is zero. Well, you, you played it. I'm pretty sure it's fine, right? Like. Oh, I see what's it. Uh, yeah, sorry, sorry. Yeah, the Arc Knight Shard is for the Spider by Assault, and I'll gain two. Yeah, sorry. I, I, thought, I thought you were talking about the Mordred. Oh, yeah, no, that, that's for... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That no, I... Six. Seven. And this is two and four. Oh, maybe creepers was fun. I actually don't know. Okay, um, so I'm gonna take the two rune chance, and I'll give you a three physical block and take one. So take three. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That sounds good. Yep. All right. Good to go. Yeah, I think so. Okay, tunic to three. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna skullbone cross wrap to flip over a bolt and shot. Opting you still one. Still cards in hand. I have three left. Yeah. Oh, you have three cards in hand. Yeah, okay. yeah. This all bottom. I thought you had four. I'm like, how are you? I, how, you know, how did I you only take three? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That makes, that makes sense. Uh, I blocked. Um, okay. I'm very tempted to Azalea here. So I think I will. Blind Azalea. Wow. Got to go for Shocking. glory. Give me, give me a buff. Oh, okay. Um... It's not a buff, but it is a knock the death whistle. Okay. Kind of the opposite. Sorry? It's kind of the opposite of a buff. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of nice to play this before I is <laughs> mm -hmm. Um but I do have to play it now it's my arsenal, so you don't much have yeah, I don't have much of a choice here. Let's but... play knock. Um Did you blind Azalea the the knock? Yeah. Okay, just checking. That's what happened. Um, so we will knock. Oh, and I think I can reload once I play it. Yeah, yeah. I rarely play the card because it's so good at pitching. <laughs> mm, that's fair. Um, so opting. Yeah, see, this is amazing before you actually play Azalea's ability because you can get a card and then opt one. Oh, and then reload. I'm sorry, not opt one. Yeah, reload one. Yeah, um, it's very good so... when you start with it. I will grab. I think I have to grab uh, Ren the Ledger at this point. Here's Ren the Ledger. Sure. Just gotta see these now. Um. So put that on top. I'm gonna reload a second Ren the Ledger. Oh, Sounds good. It's a little sad because I. Well, I can't Death Dealer, but it is what it is. Um, I'll play a Read the Glide Path. I'm going to skip the option. Imagine if you had matter. Snapdragon Scalers, but no, you just had to force my hand, didn't you? <laughs> I, actually, tell me, what would you have had in that hand? I, I didn't really keep track. 
So there's a, mo there's a uh, Mordred Tide. You would have you you would have gotten Mob Shrilled. Mob Shrilled with Mordred Tide, right? Because I know you had that because you played it on mm -hmm. the turn after I attacked. So yeah. Yep. So I would have taken three damage and been uh, at twelve. Okay. Yeah, and I would have probably taken a lot more. <laughs> but mm -hmm. it's fine. Okay. I'll it, use you know, the tunic. It, it was a good play. I'm not saying it was incorrect. Yeah. I'm just saying that you know it's the way it happened. Yeah. Okay. I'll just yeah. fire in the ledger for eight. Eight. Yeah. And then one action. Yeah, one action next turn. Yep. Okay, so it's these two for sure. I'm just thinking on the third card here. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'll block with Swarming. Okay. I don't want to, but mm. uh, there's no point taking damage here when my turn is literally just going to be resetting you. That's fair. Okay. So I only get one action, so if I if that wasn't written in the ledger, I would have definitely like probably kept more cards because I had um, Yeah. not too many more cards. Again, I, 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 I haven't drawn... The, the blues are kind of hurting me. <laughs> uh, All right. Um, I so I'm going to rose that at you. Okay. Uh, yeah. So two and then six rune chance. Oh, sorry. Seven rune chance coming at me. Yeah. It said one action, right? It doesn't include tunic activation. because I'm pretty sure it doesn't. No, no, no. That'd okay, be, okay, yeah. okay. I'm just like triple nasty. checking. Yeah, like, yeah. I, I think it's literally you just you yeah, have one action. Yeah, it's player activate more than one action during their next turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is an instant, so we're fine. Yeah. yeah. So um, I'm coming in for seven rune chance and two physical. I have one card in hand. Okay. So what I'm going to do... Nine total. Pretty good. Oh, man. Okay. I'll take the two from... Sorry. Well, well I'll, this is, I'm going to pitch... First. Yeah, I'll pitch six to knock the death whistles. To oh, take there's one. your blues. They came yeah. at the right time. And I'll take two. Yep. Arsenal pass. Yeah, not bad. Okay. Tunic... At least that was all your rune chance. Yeah, um, I mean, you know. We'll use cross wrap. Let's flip over a blue headshot. Opt one. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> mm. Not, not let me, it. Let me consider that for a sec. Okay. <laughs> oh, I have to blind Azalea. There's no way I keep this. All right. <laughs> the blue headshot? No, it was, uh, it was you... a sink below. Oh, okay. So you cross wrap that. Okay, I understand. Yeah, cross wrap, opt one. Now I'm going to yeah. blind Azalea. Mm-hmm. Oh, rob man. a god, or is it a rabble? I'll be able or to is it another any, any buff or attack I can react. play. If it's an e strike, even better. Let's go. Oh, it's a memorial grounds. So, what if I said it's neither of those? <laughs> <laughs> At least I can play this <laughs> from Arsenal. You can play it, but you've already Azalea. This is so... so funny. I have to play it. Oh, that's so sad. I can't really end my turn here. So, put a target attack action cost one or less for my graver on top of my deck. Oh, that did not work out. <laughs> that didn't work out the way I wanted. Um, okay, I think I gotta do it this way. So I'm gonna play Memorial Ground. Yep. I will so take a yeah, red ledger. Arrow. I'm gonna put that on yep. top. There. Sure. Okay. Then I will Death Dealer. Sure. I'll load. Okay. Yes. Sorry. I will pitch a Sleep Dart. To load Red in the Ledger, drawing a card, and I'll pitch Red in the Ledger to attack with Red in the Ledger. So I got it back in my deck, sure. but this is a unpowered, undominated Red in the Ledger. Un undominated Red in the Ledger? Yeah. Okay, I'm just double checking. Yep, that's what um, it is. So for five. Yeah, that's going to be a, a nice block with these two blues that I don't need in my hand. Yeah. Uh,. I thought of some funny plays with become and tome and like, creepers in, <laughs> and then just like if you, I was like thinking of things if you like passed. I'm like, yeah, hmm. There could have I'm been some, some shenanigans there. Yeah, yeah. All right. Well, that's uh, all okay. I've got, unfortunately. Yep. Tunic back on one. I have to keep remembering that's a tunic. Otherwise, mm. it's just a black card at the moment. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh. Yeah. So from my arsenal. So this was the correct arsenal, which is actually interesting that I actually made a good play. So it's a red Moths Guys. My options were Moths Guys are Swarming in the Arsenal. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, if I could get any attack action, that red Moths Guys is butter. <laughs> and uh, this is a pretty good attack action to have it. It's Spellblade Assault Red. Oh, yeah. Uh, in the blue Moths Guys. So right. it is going to be Generating two creating... Generating on the back. Oh, sorry. Two from Viscerai. Mm -hmm. and th two, two from... Uh, one no, from no. Viscerai and two and from Spellblade. two Spell from Spellblade Assault. Yes. I don't have Mordred to third. Well, I have a third Mordred, yeah, but I didn't get it yet. Yeah. So. 
So three on the back. Creating three rune champs. Yeah. And this is going to go again. And if it hits, I get another three rune champs. Yeah. So this is the, the nice place where, or a nice place to see a fate for scene. So I'm just going to use that. Um, sure. Monopt one, of course. Let's bottom that. All right. Yep. That's my block. Uh, Rosetta is coming in for three rune chants, two three, and two arcane, three, and another two arcane. And two. Okay. Three, two, two. Okay. Um, so I do have arcane one <laughs> presently. Um, yeah, so you can't block the, the full two arcane, but right. you can block like so, the rune chants. I'll pitch three, else. block all of the rune chants. Mm -hmm. Take the two arcane. I don't think it's worth giving a yep. card for a single arcane damage, and I'll block with a, uh, a dead eye yep. on the two. Sounds good. Okay. I'll uh, pass to you. Yep, I'm just going to tunic an arsenal. Passing it back. Yep. Wait, four cards? What do I do with this? <laughs> I haven't been taught on what to do with four cards. It's been a while. It's been a hot minute. Wow, these four cards are ass. Okay, good. I need a turn to catch my breath. I mean, I don't know, man. Maybe, <laughs> maybe they're good it. and I'm just a dumbass. I'm not sure. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm going to become the Arknight, which is not something I say very often out loud. Mm. <laughs> we had to discard a blue spell, but so, see, now I'm getting two, all blues. Before I was getting all reds. <laughs> so, That's how uh, it goes. Uh, Spellblade Assault, so I'm going to be getting a non-attack action. Uh, I just thought you pitch a whole shit ton of blues, so maybe this is a hand where you don't have a ton, but... <laughs> What do I know? What I miss is my D-Reacts. I don't know where the heck. Well, you had the fate. And oh, the sink you put to the bottom, remember? I did, I did. You, uh, you azaleaed one to the bottom. It's true. Uh, didn't so appreciate is this, it enough. This just shows a hand, right? It shows you how much I've actually used this card before. Yeah, yeah, it goes to uh, hand. Yeah. Reveal it with the hand <laughs> shuffle, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so I'll then play it. I'll generate a rune shan off Mr. I. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm gonna pitch my second blue spell blade assault wall. <laughs> um, to yeah. play consuming volition. It's a good time to have the become the Arknight. Yeah, yeah, it's it, it's it's a good card in literally this scenario. Mm -hmm. Um, so essentially, there's gonna be one. So I'm gonna create a rune chant off the back of consuming. Yeah. Because of this Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna have one rune chant coming in here. This consuming has go again. Uh, Moth's guys is red, so on hit is three damage. A uh, three rune chants also. If you let this arcane and this hits, you just go a card. Yep. Okay. Um, what's uh, your floating? Two? Uh, two. Okay. Yep. Uh, let's see. I can't really take much more damage. I mean, <laughs> no, you cannot. Well, I literally, because I'm at 12, but also I don't want to go yeah. much lower just for a comeback turn. It's not really worth it right now, I think. I, uh, Unless your turn is like excellent, no, but you. Not. But the problem is there's the rune chant, so you you have to give me a card because otherwise consuming is gonna take a card, or oh, yeah. whether you like yeah. it or not, right? Because if you take the rune chant here and consuming hits, then you can't keep your full hand. So you need to decide what you can do with like. But your full um, hand is kind of. Whatever, I'll pitch right? a blue headshot. I'll block the one. Yeah. And what do you like to do about this consuming? Yeah. Well, this is gonna be a. An easy two block. Sorry, an easy two card block. Two so card block. I bet. I'm gonna give you. It's too bad that they're all red. I'll give you E Strike and Bolton Shot. E Strike and Bolton Shot. Yeah. For six. Yep. Uh, yeah. No, that makes sense. Uh, I'm gonna one two two you. Yeah. So one two two. So I'll block the two remaining. Um, so I'll block the Rune Chant and one of the Arcane from Rosetta. Take one, take one, and I'll block the two with a Sleep Dart. All right. Um, We're just kind of trading cards at this point, which is fine. It's fine, yeah. I think that's that favors you a little bit. I'm gonna tune. Yeah, eventually, in you're gonna pass. draw like a really clunky D react hand, and I'm just gonna be like pog. Yeah, exactly. Well, I'm, yeah. <laughs> I want to get one or two at least on the turns where you want to like hit me for a lot and just kind of come back. That's yeah, that's fair. what has to happen. Okay, pass two. I'm I'm a bit worried because I haven't seen a single rebel from you yet. I know you pitched, I pitched one. one. You pitched one. Yeah. Still if I had Revel here, I'd be super happy. Uh, but instead, I have Mauv. Wait for it. Mauv, Mauv. <laughs> Those are two reds. Uh, no, it's a yellow, and I'm pitching a yellow and a red to okay. play this rude flesh. <laughs> Go get <it> anyways. <laughs> but I think I, I think I have to do this, because otherwise, you're literally just going to, like, whatever. So I create a root shot off the How back, much damage is this for? 
It's just four go again. Okay. Uh, on the on hit, I create two rune chants. So. But you're you're floating, right? No, I'm not floating. Oh, I did that three. cost three? Oh. <laughs> I have tunic up, but it cost me three. I had no rune chants up, but I'm just like, why am I so bad at this game? Okay. I'm gonna fade for seeing that opt one. That's fine. Uh, that'll keep on top, sure. Yeah, I'll get a tunic to Rosetta here. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna pitch a release the tension to block one arcane. Mm -hmm. So I'll take two from the Rosetta. And I'll block the Rosetta with a take aim. Sure. All right. Okay. So on my turn, I'm going to cross wrap, flip over Memorial Ground. This should be what I saw before. Yes. <laughs> and um, I'm then going to use the. Oh, sorry. I'm going to use Azalea to mm -hmm. bottom this and put a Seek and Destroy face up. I am then going to play it, and I'll use the Tunic Charge to Death Dealer. I'll load a Bolton Shot draw card, mm -hmm. and I'll fire it, coming in for six only. I guess what I'm going to do, block with... Okay. This doesn't do much for me when I have no blues. And then... Meet and greet red. Okay. Full block, I'll move to Arsenal. Yeah, you're good. All right. Uh, yeah, I can't can't do anything about this. Um, I'm going to pitch a rebel this one for two. Okay, yeah. Okay, I'll block the Rosetta with a drill shot for three. Sure, Arsenal pass. All right. Okay. Oh. Tunic. I'm going to cross wrap, flipping up a sink below. Uh, this is a red one for anyone wondering. It's just a proxy. Um, opt. Seems reasonable. Opt isn't bad. I think I'll... Yeah, I'll keep the opt there. Keep the card mm -hmm. there. Uh, I'm going to um, have to Azalea this. Yep. So I'll take a drill shot with Dominate. That's pretty good. It's not bad. So yeah, if this... Um... Hits, I put a minus one counter on any equipment that you control, so that could go on creepers, I guess. Um, yeah, I mean, it wouldn't die, but you could put yeah, it on creepers. You lose an armor. Yeah. Okay. I'm it's a good thing go... I don't. It's a good thing I blocked with the twos and twos already. Like, a good thing I blocked with, like, the, the two defense on them already. Yeah. Be real sad. That is true. You essentially force the block on them right there. Yeah. I'm going to go with an E strike, bottoming a card, coming in for five. Go again. Uh, I'm going to block this one for five. I'm going to block with a rebel, which is my... Th mm. Well, I mean, I have two rebels back in the... I haven't actually yeah. used a rebel yet. You've only still been pitching them, yeah. Well, I've only been pitching them, yeah. Uh, all right, full block uh, on that. Third. Okay. Yeah, because well, I think that's a buff. It is. <laughs> Seek and destroy. Yeah, that's fine. It's like, why did you have to be right? Uh, yeah, so seven jewel shot with Seek and destroy attached to it. Dominate. Yeah, so... Oh, it's the correct block on you strike then, because I would have yeah. just been stuck with a whole lot of nothing in my hand. <laughs> I guess I should block with grasp, because that's like the most reasonable block. Because like you can block creepers or tunic, but I'm not I'm not blocking those until you're. I, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah. So I will block grasp. Um, so it'll be taking some Six. one, two, three, four, five. Six. So we're even. So I'll go on, down to that. And I'll put you a minus tunic? one. Uh, let's go with creepers. Sure, that will... Because you're more likely to block so. with that, I guess, so... Yeah. So I'm, I'm going to put this one up here. I'm going to put this one, like, up right. <laughs> okay, yeah. sure there's, like, there's, like, one off, because otherwise... That's I'm fine. All right, I'll pass to you. Yeah. Actually, is there a different... Oh, oh, I got a different color of dice. Okay, so let's put this... Oh, nice. There's a different die. Yeah. So, All right. But I need to remember yeah. for the actual activation, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. One, two... You have no arsenal, right? No. That was... That was everything. Okay, so that's a little bit of good news. Mm. Uh, pitch a shrill to activate grasp. Mm -hmm. uh, one rune chant. Have one floating. It's not a great turn, but I did arsenal swarming gloomvale. Oh, um, so I am so able to come three. in with it for uh, one and three go again. One and three go yeah. again. I don't. Have, I don't have a non-attack, so I can't. Can't really. Mm. Or that is not going to be great here, but. Yeah, that's fair. I don't know. Still I'm, I'm okay two. taking one card. I'm okay taking one card for one rune <laughs> I think I have to give that to you, actually. Um, 
Okay. One arcane and three go again. Three physical go again. The one arcane I will take, unfortunately. Yep, I'll take. Um, and I think I have to sync this. So I'm going to activate sync below. Um, mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's a full block. Yep. Uh, you seek and destroy it. So I don't have a choice here, do I? <laughs> All right. Um, Ooh, consuming. Yeah, give me another card. Yeah, here's a fate for scene that I just drew. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. Opt one. Seems good. Eh, I'll keep it there. I would have preferred to just swing Rosetta and Arsenal it, but not much of a choice there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay, Tunic at two now. Yep. Because it's a Tunic, not a three Nic. Ha oh, ha. Oh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Make it stop. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. I'm going to pitch a release the tension to Death Dealer, loading Bolton Shot, drawing um, sure. the arrow that I wanted to load. Uh, ah. I mean, that's all my bad. And I got to fire this. Here you go. Three damage. Oh, I can block that. Oh, it's a yellow it's a hog. Yellow. Yeah. Here's a three block blue. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> I'm an arsenal past you. Oh, yeah. It's funny, I should probably be keeping vexings because they're now lethal. They, yeah, it's true, it's true, it's true. Oh, running out of cards. Um, I think I'm at like 12 or 15, 12 to 15 cards, roughly. So it's... Uh, I have got more, but not by that much. I can I count know. if you want. Oh, it's okay. It's not necessary. Um, we're not going to fatigue. Uh, I'm, I'm at 21 cards. You. Yeah, it's more than me. 21 in deck with 3 in hand. Yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll just count for just to make sure. 3, 3. You three. know the best part? 15. About anti fatigue mm -hmm. is rattle bones. Yeah. Anti fatigue, because now I get to come in here, grab yeah. something special. I mean, it's always swarming, is it not? Yeah. Like, it's when true. is it never? When is it not swarming? No, it's um, always swarming. Unless you want to shrill swarming. the mob, but. It, it's always. It's always. <laughs> Remember, you just saw me like pitch two mobs. Like, that's not. It's not. They're not coming. They yeah, come back. Yeah, yeah, it's true. The it's red true. and the yellow. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm going to grab swarming and play swarming. Or I guess banish swarming and play it. Uh, right. It's gonna create a rune shine off this yeah, right? Three. Um, and it's coming in for three go again. Yeah, I'll give you a dead eye <clears throat> for three here. Give me a dead eye. Mm -hmm. Should I big brain or not big brain? Oh, AKA play, play your uh, creepers. No, uh, tunic oh. go to two. Uh, command and conquer. Oh. All right, let's see what I got here. Um. Uh, I mean, I could have Rosetta. Um, it's true. But yeah, I, I, I want to put you, pressure because you, you don't have many cards no, left. So yeah, okay, that's that's is, this is why um because you don't have infinite three blocks. So no. I felt like Command and Conquer is better at this stage of the game. Okay, I'll tunic and pass it back to you. Sure, I'll tunic also back I to one. I don't know if I can fight the fatigue honestly. Oh hey, I forgot this card was in the deck, but I sonata, so I shuffled it, and I become the Arknight, so I shuffled it again. Uh, Gorganian tone. <laughs> okay. Draw a card. Yeah. That it existed. Totally forgot that existed. Yep. Um. <clears throat> hmm. That's interesting. Um, Moss guys, Crater Enchant. Is that blue? So Moss guys, blue. Okay. Yeah, those are the ones I pitched early. Mm -hmm. They just came back, I guess. Yeah. Um, blue Shrill of Skull Form pitching it's become the Arc Knight. Yeah, so it's still, and that's gonna, it's gonna be two Rune Shant, so I'm gonna create a Rune Shant off the Shrill itself. Yeah. Uh, so it's gonna be uh, five go again, uh, one Rune Shant on hit. And two Rune Shants coming in before that. I have one card in hand, one floating. All right. Um, I'll pitch headshot and I'll block two of the rune chants. One floating. Mm -hmm. um, you got one card in hand and you said one floating. One floating. Yeah, I just pitched for shrill, but that's it. Yeah. I'm gonna have to do this. Uh, I'm gonna sink below, block, bottom a card. Yep. So I'll take sure. one, give you a rune chance. Yep. Like, yeah. Uh, I know. Okay. I know. I know. You know what's coming next. Is that a... <laughs> yeah. two, 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 two? Okay. Or I should say one, one, two, two. Okay. Yeah, I got to 
give you um, one rune chance. I block one of the arcane from the rune chance, and I'll take. Um, oh, interesting. I can do this instead. I'll pitch another blue, and I'll block two more arcane, and take one, take one from arcane. Rosetta. Yep. And I'll take the two from the Rosetta. Yep, okay. Arsenal Pass. Okay. All right, let's use the cross wrap, flip over a drill shot, revealing that. Bring that card. Um, Yeah, I'll keep it on top. Yeah, I guess Man, I'll am I happy you don't have snaps? Uh, I'm going to Azalea, put this on bottom. Here's Red in the Ledger. Dominate. Oh, <laughs> fuck. Uh, <okay. laughs> you might get my armor here, the rest of it. Yeah, well, that's fair. Oh, I can't. Well, you're two. You only have tunic. <laughs> All right, yeah. and I'm gonna use tunic to fire it for five. Dominate. There you go. Uh, okay, that's pretty good. I was kind of hoping. I mean, this is good, but I was hoping for like a buff so that I can pitch for death dealer. But uh, this is fine. And there's no way that I'm keeping a big blow at hand with red in the ledger anyway. So this is probably as good as it's gonna get. Yeah, that's reasonable. Um. Yeah. Uh, it's gonna be shrill, so I'll take two. Okay, I'll move to Arsenal. Yep. All right. Um, going to tunic. Uh, could be worse. It's a, it's a blue amplify, so I'm still coming in oh. for lethal. It's for four, eh? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's could be bad. worse. It's not bad. Wow, can't believe that drill shot actually just did so much work there. Just turned into. Oh yeah, it turned off your uh, your block. Yeah, yeah that's true. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, I just block with that in armor. Yeah, it was quite good. And I come back with this blue shrill. <laughs> yeah. With lethal charge, which is now in my pitch pitch zone. Okay. Uh, there's no one hit. No, I won't give you tunic. I'm just going to block three, take one. Over to you. All right. This game might still last three more turns. So tunic. I'm going to cross wrap, flipping a sleep dart. Um, hmm. Let me think. Yeah, it's not worth doing this. Okay, I'm going to keep that there. And sure. I am just going to be pitching... Um, no, not yet. I'm going to play Release the Tension for plus three. Yep. And sure. I'll pitch to fire the Sleep Dart for eight. Here. Let's uh, let's make this interesting. I just want to okay. try something. I'm okay. going to block with Mortar type okay. because yeah. you're going to turn out this try anyway. Well, is this great just like an extra one? It would be one extra only from Viscerai. So it turns off Viscerai, period, well, though. So yeah, matter. yeah. So depending on how many cards you play, you're, I'm disabling that many rune chance. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I Viscerai guess you would want to start off with a non attack. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, like a grass would still work, but Viscerai wouldn't. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to take five here, unless you have All some right. kind of reaction to uh, I do not. So I'm going to move to Arsenal. Okay. Two, three, four, five. All right. I don't know. I just want to keep it interesting. You, you probably have something in there to kill me, but uh, we'll see. Mm. We'll see. I mean, I that was that was the minimum I could have blocked with, right? Mm. Like essentially, I can't. I can't. Uh, I guess I could have blocked with a two block, but mm -hmm. that's pretty much it. Yeah. But the thing is, turning off Viscera is really good here because I had Mordred. So if you didn't turn off Viscera, you would have died for sure. Yeah, that's fair. Um, just because you only have AB1, so like mm -hmm. I only need to do two damage to you, then Rosetta kills you. <laughs> yeah, that's true, that's true. All right, you want to see what I got? Show it. Double Rebel? Uh, no. <laughs> uh, we're going to uh, we're gonna pitch six into Sonata Arcanics. Oh, oh my <laughs> goodness. So you get, uh, is that five cards? Yeah, so X is three. Yeah, okay. uh, So I get six cards. Oh, you get six. So if I hit, if I hit literally that... And you take two, and I Rosetta, I win the game. That is literally my win cost. <laughs> okay, flip them slowly, Go one, one at a time. This is, this is gonna, I figure this is going to be the most entertaining way to either win or lose the game. Yeah, I approve of this. Okay. All right. Let's, let's I, I have, the this. problem is I was trying to count. I was trying to count how like the stack. How likely I've, this would be? I have no idea. I have zero idea. <laughs> what this is. All right. What do we got? All right. All right. All Show right. me. Okay. I'm off. Okay. Well, okay. there they are. They are. Okay. I knew. I knew they were there. Yeah. Uh, so oh, one. there's one. Nope. Okay. Just one attack. Uh, this is C and C. Ah, uh, yeah. Two. Okay, that's that's. Okay. That's well, still, I missed. I mean, you missed, but 
it still hurts. Um, so I'm going to be doing two arcane. Yeah, but this might still be lethal. Um, I have to pitch this. Memorial ground. <laughs> so I have one floating, I take one, yeah. I was yep. gonna, I was gonna I... keep the memorial ground. Yeah, I think I lose now because oh, I really? literally needed. Um. Yeah, like, I'll get these to hand, but. I guess you can't gain go again. Um, My hand is pretty is underwhelming. Good. I don't know. We'll we'll see what happens because I'm I'm not even sure how this is gonna play out. My my whole plan involved using memorial grounds to get like a red the ledger back on top, so. Uh, that's, true. Uh, that's true. Probably just keep um, this. Uh, you have one floating, right? So yeah. okay, wouldn't make a sense to make a rune chant here then. Right. Um, yeah, I think I have to just B and C here. Yeah. I have one floating, I guess. Yeah. We'll see what happens. I don't I know. Gotta give you E strike and fatigue shot. Two of my big cards. <laughs> E strike and fatigue shot. Yeah. You have how many cards in hand? One. Left. One. Yeah. All right. How big brain is Eric here? Now, if you pitch, so if you spend one on creepers to you know rebel, what I'm, we're, we're doing it. We're I don't have rebel. If I had rebel, I'd be a god, but oh, I don't okay. have rebel. Okay. Um. If it was rebel, I'm just dead. Although you would need a pitch for Rosetta, so maybe not. Yeah, I could bring you to one and take your last card. Right, that's worth it. Because that means you just got to set up I Rosetta think, and I yeah. die. Uh, I'll pitch. I'll use my last pitch to use Creepers. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, Moss Guys. Okay. Moss Guys. Uh... Yeah. Uh, as an instant to gain my action point back. Uh -huh. uh, use tunic, swing with Rosetta for two. Oh yeah, two. tunic. Okay, yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'll give you. I'll pitch. I would have Yeah. Yeah, of course. Yeah. yeah I'll, I'll pitch one, one, take one, and I have a sling below, so I'll block with yeah. that. Yeah. Because I'm like, I take your last card because you can't use tunic to block because you're still it's still lethal. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, so I did. Okay, so creepers is technically now on one. True. Uh, because I've now used it. All right, I'm going right. to tunic and pass back to you. Um, I took all my brain power. I don't know what I have left in the tank. <laughs> you, yeah, I mean, you, you, I mean, good news for me is once I get one good Azalea off, I can win, but I don't even know what's left. But you're, 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 you're at one, so Rosetta wins the game. Yeah, exactly. Uh, so if you, if you get it, uh, you get it. I think I have it because I'm just going to become the Arc Knight. Okay. Um, yeah, because I have a blue attack and I have Arc Knight Shark. Okay, yeah, let's let's. I, I, I have I have mop, I have mop. Let's call it there. It's a long game. Oh, it's gonna be. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna, That's good. it's gonna be Revel. Uh, I'll grab Shrill, I guess. Yeah. And then I have Shrill, uh, Red Mob pitching Arc Knight Shark to play it. I'll have one floating, and then I'll be able to. Um, Even a Shrill Mob is like freaking annoying. Yeah. yeah, this is actually this is actually one rune chant like already. So this is a rune uh -huh. chant here, and then this is gonna come in for one rune chant in five, and then yeah. one rune chant off the back. So you need to yeah, pitch. Yeah, exactly. Um, I did have a lot of blue, but it, it wasn't feasible. I think. Um, yeah. That's that. That's the rest of your hand too. Yeah. Okay. This was my sense. hand here, and this was the rest of my deck. And my deck had I had memorial grounds, so I could have sure I could have still gotten a dominated five, uh, for game. Well, yeah, yeah, tunic mm -hmm. actually. So no, it wasn't even game. Yeah, it's true. Uh, yeah, I, I, my tunic's no, is still still blockable. Um, yeah. Funnily enough, I still have one last sonata left in the deck. So if that didn't oh. work, I was gonna try the sonata the third <laughs> time because that was only my second sonata. I actually didn't put that sonata to banish. Uh, I, yeah. I had a blue that headshot. Sonata should be here. Yeah. Sonata All right. So that was a game. Um, just for my side, I I'm still on the on the fence whether or not I should have like cracked my armor there. You did block lightly which made me feel that if i did get a second red in the ledge uh red in the ledge no it was um remorseless that that would have punished you heavily for not really blocking as much but you kind of as you said it made your choice more clear that you weren't gonna play everything you just save your health yeah so i i played these two pieces just to prevent a big turn from you which might have been okay i just don't know how much damage potential you had there yeah so that that turn uh, for anyone watching, the, the the turn I had was I had to block with Moth Strill, so I had 
uh, I had Mordred tied, mm -hmm. um, red. It was red and yellow. It was red trail yellow moth. So it was um, pitch of blue. Sorry, Mordred tied, mm -hmm. Mav Mavrin skies create two rune chance yep. off Viscerai. Pitch of blue, place trail create two more rune chance and swing for two. Um, and swing for well, the shrill would have been seven go, uh, yeah. seven go again with um, so two rune chance, two rune the chance back. and then the Rosetta seven, would have hit you for nine, two, two, and two. So 15 damage, so, and I prevented pretty much all of that. So yes, you prevented you all of it, yeah, yeah. And I would have, I would have just taken three, so I would have went gone down to 12, but I present a lot more than that, so I would have taken that any yeah. chance, any chance to get, which is what I was planning on. Like, I wasn't expecting the snaps into the second remorseless, right? Yeah, you're just like, yeah. yep. No, now I can't. Like I can't I, do it. Yeah, I, I guess it might have been worth it. Kind of hard to tell, but uh, you know, if I if I because went back, I might have just done I, it again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if I if I let the second one hit, I'd take two. Like they stack. That's yeah. two different cards. So you would take so six would damage take... there from playing the three cards, right? Or uh, you would play yeah. Mordred. Mo yeah, three cards. So you would take six there. Yeah, yeah which I didn't feel was uh, worth it because. Um, and you take the damage from the the second low... remorseless also, right? So that's five plus the six, eleven. Uh, well, I would have taken three and three. You would have right? blocked with one I would have card taken, on the second um, one. No, it was either full block or no or no block at all. I needed all the rest of my cards. Okay. Because my hand was my hand was blue, a blue card, Moff Shrill. and my arsenal was a Mordred Tide, right? Because uh, you made yeah. me play the Mordred Tide because of the um, Seek and Destroy. So I Mordred Tide Grasp that turn instead, right? Right. Yeah. So um, that was in my arsenal, but I needed to keep, is either keep all my cards yeah. and take the five. Yeah, but my hand doesn't do anything. It's literally Moff Shrill, but I have no pitch. Yeah. So, so you, uh, you would have full blocked my Remorseless, is what you're saying. The second one, I no doubt in my mind, the second yeah. one is I needed to block it because that yeah. would have been um, uh, two, two, two. I would have taken six, yeah. but then for taking six, I would have taken yeah. six plus the five for Remorseless. That's, so, that's as you said, I would have taken so 11. 11. Yeah, yeah. Just to so, I would have went from 15, 15 to yeah. So I would have, yeah, but I would have been, I would have went down from 15 to four. To four? <laughs> yeah. And you have dominate and I don't have Arbor. So that's a yeah. bad play. Yeah. So that one made it easy for me. But right. if it was another arrow, then I would have had to think about it. Yeah. But because that was literally remorseless, then yeah, I, I, it was yeah. pretty easy for me. I was like the one arrow. the ledger, you would have also Red the ledger, Red the ledger, sure. I would have blocked. Yeah. Yep. Yep. We're blocked by the ledger for sure. Those yeah. are the two big ones. But if it was just like a, a vanilla a damage. shot, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I would have had to think about it. Yeah, I'm not sure. requires more maybe time. because it's yeah. it's still going down to four or five, right? So yeah, um, the snaps was definitely like the right the right play, 100. percent You okay. didn't know what I had, but and even in hindsight, it was just like the right play. Yeah. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Yeah. Um, on my side, I definitely didn't play optimally. I don't think. Well, hard, I think the very, say. I think the very like the turn where I had. Um, the flash, the rune flash, where I pitched three. Yeah, it was mauve uh, red, I... mauve yellow. No, the turn before that, I think, or maybe you're right. I'm not sure. And I had like a swarming or something like that in Arsenal. There, there was one turn where I was like trying to think if there was a a better uh, combination or a, a better line with spellbound creepers. But uh, my issue was always pitch. Like my issue was always pitch, right? It was either four reds, four yeah, reds, four blue. three blues, three blues. Yeah. yeah, three blues, four blues. I never got four blues, but I had three blues twice in a row, right after my eight reds. So, I, I kind of, I think I did what the deck gave me. I think I played what I could without like taking way too much damage for no reason. Yeah. Um, like the Mordred turn for the grass was obviously not ideal, but like it could have been. Uh, sorry, sorry. The, yeah, yeah. The yeah. play Mordred pitch, like it's when you get hit remorseless, remorseless. One of them seek and destroy. You can't keep the Mordred. Yeah, so that's it's right, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but I, I managed to like claw back with the big, um, the second Mordred. So the Mordred that I was able to uh, get seven rune chance off the back. Yeah, the Mordred. That was, that was good. So you used tunic just to Rosetta for nine, pretty much. Yeah, I had a blue. Yeah, exactly. So I had a blue assault. Um. Mauve, I think, right? So I I played the Mordred, um, played the. I think I played this. Yeah, played the Mordred, played the Salt, pitching the Arknight shard, right? So I was able to off the three card hand essentially. Generate seven off the back. Oh yeah, two yeah. from Viserai, three from the thing, and then exactly it was a two two three pretty much. 
Yeah, it was a two, two, three. Maybe it was grasp too. I forgot. Anyways, the point uh, is the second Arknight, one would Shard, allow me. Sure. I pit Arknight. Yeah. yeah, yeah, Arknight. Sorry. So it was Arknight, Viserai, um, and, and yeah, two, assault. two, three that way. But it was a three card yeah. hand. Yeah, yeah. It was it was three card hand that let me kind of like able to tunic for nine. Yeah, effective. Very good. Which was quite strong. Um, <laughs> yeah. So I don't think I made like any. And then I, I like, I put all my eggs into the creeper's basket. I think if I didn't, I lose because I start to get into two block territory. Like this is the rest of my deck. So I have lead, revel, lead, lead. I only have two, three blocks left mm. in the deck, other than this hand. Yeah. So I think I have to send out to try to get you to one. I, I know the mix is actually not terrible. Like I, ha I could miss, but like I have enough attack action still in the deck that, you know, could yeah. be okay. But I needed to hit. Um, That's fair. And off six, yeah, you know, X is three, is six cards. You probably get a hit at least one, if not two. Three is pushing it, yeah. but you know, not a god. <laughs> but uh, yeah, yeah, other than that, I thought it was an interesting game. I still think this is not favored in this matchup. Uh, it's very, very difficult to actually get all my turns across, even though. Yeah. Uh, and then Rob didn't have anything. I, I, I would think just it works like, both oh, ways, though, because it's true that I yeah. can be oppressive, but also the room chance are kind of hard to block sometimes. Uh, on a turn where yeah, I there have was, like there a single some turns. yellow plus some reds, it's like I'll take. Yeah, I think there was the one, one turn I took a bunch of arcane damage because I only had four reds. You yeah, that was like the one turn uh, where I was able to chip a lot to like get yeah. us to even. I was yeah, like taking the golden shot. Uh, yeah. Then then you started to get your all your blues and you got your sinks and your fates off my uh, like like your deck. You, the, that deck does very well countering this deck because I'm running meet and greets and consuming the, so all the fours. Bad. Yeah. It's, it's yeah. You can see I didn't hit very many of them. Like one consuming True. was like okay, I had to commit right to the block. so much into the yeah. consumings. It was like okay, take two cards. I'm not letting you hit yeah. with that. I mean, greed. I ended up blocking with anyways, like because yeah. that was one of the all right hands. So, right. Um, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. I think I I got a bit lucky on the Sonata hitting the two arcane there, but I kind of had to, uh, yeah. and then I was able to like see the the line where it's like creepers Rosetta, and then yep, you know, try to just win off was it? whatever my last attack actions are, but. Uh, and I knew I had one become the Ark Knight, so if I got become also, that would have worked. Um, but yeah, hopefully yeah. everyone kind of enjoyed this. This uh, we're not going to be playing Viscerai for a little while. <laughs> um, and with that, you know, if you like that kind of content, this kind of content, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And with that, from wherever you're watching in the world, have a good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Bye for now.